I'm not okay with you guys being in here without a warrant, regardless of the circumstances. And I'd appreciate it if you would leave. Okay. You asked them for a warrant. I did ask them for a warrant. The reason they could yeah, come in is for this. Yeah, we asked for a warrant. They said we're going in anyway. It's 3 a.m. right now, and we're gonna go take the chickens out of the chicken coop that we put them in earlier today. And hopefully they're in the box because they like to go home at night. So I'm hoping the box is their home for now because I'm going to pick up the box and I'm going to throw it over to the fence into the other chicken coop so that they all think that they always lived there because chickens aren't that smart. different than sitting in the coop, right? There we go. There's a lot of ice in the actual tear down the old chicken city because we're going to pave it and put up a parking lot. All right. Let's tear it all down, I guess. Are we found two axles? Are we, are we taking this down too? Yeah. I don't want to destroy shit though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we should probably like neatly wrap it up so we can reuse it. I think I did. Nice. We should keep the doors too. Oh, yeah, just right where they are. Landmark status? Exactly. It's like you're you the first chicken, chicken city. city. Yeah. <laughs> Is your side oh, broken or is it still like connected? This part is coming off, but I need to get it off the top as well. It's stapled in heaven. I mean, I know yeah, we have like, tools in the garage. Yeah, bolt cutters or something. Or the but shed. It's almost like more fun trying to do it just with hands. <laughs> okay, I got a package. It almost got sent back to Japan because I was away for the holidays. Pretty exciting. And because I got myself a new phone. 
I don't know if you've noticed, but recently uh, it seems like everybody thinks that the future has to be all about touchscreens just because of Star Trek got it in everybody's minds that touchscreens are the only way that you can interface with a computer anymore. Back in the day, we used to interface with computers using physical buttons that you'd press down and it would be a tactile sensation that would go through the nerves in your fingers and all the way travel down through your like nerve nerves through your nervous system into your spine and then up into your brain and your brain would notice the feeling of your fingers touching the thing and like the, the the shape of the thing that you're touching and for some reason we've abandoned that except with this phone there's a slide out QWERTY keyboard or not slide out it's actually fold out and it's like a tiny little laptop it's called the Cosmo Communicator and uh, I'm pretty excited about it you can also use it as a phone like this What does it do that makes it better than something else? Uh, well, they advertise it as you you can actually dual boot with Linux on it. It's a computer. And yeah, I mean, it's a it's an Android phone that you can use as a regular phone. It's got a, another little display right here, but you can also open it up and you can interface. But it's basically got that one screen. Yeah, you can interface. Well, it's got this screen and then it's also but got that this screen. And the front is microscopic. Yeah, so this one's just for like, oh, that's you know somebody's name pop up when mine's, you. Mine's a big screen. I want to open it. It's got, it's got two screens. Yeah, but you don't have a tactile QWERTY keyboard on it, and <laughs> who needs to feel stuff? Yeah, you can't put Linux on that thing. Yes, you can. I mean, you could if you really wanted to. <laughs> You've got like some developers oh, uh, to help you out. Take that from the DOJ site. Sure. Jack Posobiec and us talked about this scientist who pled guilty wow. for stealing biomedical tech secrets for China um, and the Department of Justice had made a release about it so I went to take a screenshot of the page with the release and the release is gone uh, but you can find it in archive so it clearly existed so weird so this actually kind of feels like a movie to me for this to be gone and for her to have said that freaking wild like future prediction thing like I don't know what's going on also there's a shoulder food coming we're getting a bunch of sliders, Ooh. and uh, I don't even know what else I ordered. I got what's called a chicken wing bar, and 24 sliders. Oh shit! I don't know what the chicken wing bar is. Hopefully it's enough food. Maybe it's not enough food. Bar sounds like a lot of food, right? Chicken wing bar, it says. It might only be like 30 wings, I don't know. Maybe it's just a bar of wings. 24 sliders I got. Sounds like it'll be enough. Now let's get by it. If you get tired, I'll take a swing. It's like fun. Yeah, go for it. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah! I'm actually kind of curious as to why this isn't doing the thing. Yeah, it's really not competitive. Well, I'll give it one more shot. Alright. All right. Okay, winded. <laughs> it's also tiring. Here, I'll take another shot at it. I think I found a new technique. It's almost like a golf swing. Like the less, less I try, the the easier the. Oh! Shit! It was like an even try. It's all buried like a foot under the ground, so we have to pull it out from the ground. Getting people to work out in the house has been a freaking workout in the first place. Tomorrow's the training. We need to know exactly how many people are here so we have the right equipment here ready for everyone. Everyone in the house is going to have to sign here. So let's divide this into two categories. I think that's going to be fair here. First list is people working out. Second list is lazy fat who don't care about world 
So uh, this is gonna help expedi expediate this process so we know exactly who's working out. The camera guy's working out. Nick's here. Nick, do you want to do the... Now we have contracts. I'm gonna take them to a court of law if I have to. If they, because last time we were like, okay, we're all working out, we're all coming, yeah. People skipped out to watch a movie? Freaking Spider-Man? Ben, we demand your presence immediately. We're giving you the option to sign up. Is this the witnesses? This is the, the, the contract that says you're gonna work out tomorrow at 3.30. Yes, of course I'm Okay, sorry. good, all right, yeah. all right, good job, Ben. I think people think that if they watch Spider-Man, man, they become Spider-Man without doing any work. People are lucky I don't make them sign it in blood. Rain all right, Ben, shine, cool. See you tomorrow at 3.30. Yeah. Great, all right, you got two. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. I don't think I should even bother with, with this Loch Ness monster creature who keeps hiding in his dwelling this whole time. Mr. Mr. Crossland? He's sleeping. Four o'clock. Mr. Carter? What's up, man? Your presence is requested for tomorrow, 3.30 p.m. workout. Let's do it. You have to have what, uh, same drill as last time? Uh, 3.30, just come. Are we, are we doing like calisthenics? I have no idea. Okay. Cool. It's whatever you decide. 3.30? Cool. Yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, man. Sweet. I'm just doing better than ever. We're uh, demanding everyone's request to see if they're going to be working out tomorrow. We have to sign up on the list to make it official. What time is it? 3.30. Yeah. All right, that's good. We're doing good. I'm surprised. This next part's going to be a little difficult here. <laughs> Oh, you're coming to me? Oh, crack. Oh, you're gonna do it. You got two places to sign. Miracle! What? Miracle! It's because Charlie's home. I have to see him. Who? My boyfriend. No. It's my only day off. No, it's not. Saturday's my day off too, but. Friday. Friday is my day no, off. Not. I don't oh, record on Friday. Yeah. Yeah, but you work. That doesn't like, you're supposed to I be here. work. At home remote. Like, I I have no. <laughs> Miracle, you have a chance and opportunity right now to better your life, better your physical and mental health right now. Okay. Just with one decision. Okay. This is a contract that you're signing. Can I bring for... Charlie? Sure. Actually, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, okay, fine. I can bring Charlie. All right. Linda? You know, like Linda. Sure. I don't know who you're talking to. Linda, will your presence be? Who's Linda? Is they're available for us tomorrow. Let's put it all you on have a, You have an option. 3,600 all, yeah. all the way down. Yep. Brett? <clears throat> nope. Brett? Brett! Well, you gotta sign it either way. You gotta sign one. You got two options. I got two options. You got two options. You are either a lazy fuck yeah. who doesn't care about the world or a motivated individual who wants to see. What's stay. that one say? People working out. Okay. Ah! Yes! I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine. What if I can't go? And then there's, you You just signed a contract. You will be sued in a court of oh, law. Man. I will bring you, you to civil jurisdiction and justice for your huge misdirection against <laughs> the <laughs> best <What? laughs> possibility of creating a life for yourself. That was a Lucas. Wait, wait, wait. Misdirection. I like that. It might be a real word. You know exactly what I'm trying to say. You just signed the contract saying you have to be there. There's no excuses. Luke, I thought you didn't like the state. No. The state, the, state has no <laughs> the state has nothing to do with contracting with individuals voluntarily. This is a voluntarily contract. This is a voluntary contract with individuals. See you guys tomorrow. I got harassed into it. No, you did not. You signed. We have it on record and on camera. You voluntarily signed. Bring out your workout with equipment. You will be sweating and you will be working out for the betterment of yourself and humanity. Energy. I don't want to hear no excuses. Well, we have an injured person here. I assumed you were going to try to convince me anyway. Well, if you are, like, like, I, don't want, I don't want to be responsible for like, getting hurt or worse. I see. Yeah. I see. yeah. <laughs> and then there might be some limitations because the personal trainer probably wouldn't want to do it for like safety reasons as well. Just because if you are lifting while you're injured, even if you're doing something that's not related to it, you could potentially get hurt. Oh, I agree. You don't have to convince me. Yeah. No. Get it. We got one more. Here we go. Yep. Yeah. Well, excuse me. It's supposed to snow tonight. 
I don't care. And it does not matter. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. No, 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 no. We had a verbal contract. We did. All right, I'll sign up. 3 30. Oh, damn it. Wait, you said 4.30. 3.30. You said 4.30. No, 4.30. No, no. Excuse you, you see the shenanigans <laughs> and propaganda I have to deal with? Do you see you this? You say it. Lazy, fat. <laughs> you can sign that if you want it, but it's on record through the cameras and the contracting system that you are one of these individuals. You did say 4.30. Now it's 3.30? Yes. All right. Fine. Fine. Okay. I'm doing it. Good. But if the snow melts by Saturday and I don't get to go skiing. We can go skiing here. There's no hill here. Good. Can you go skiing in the morning and then come? Because yeah. you feel like you really can't because it's like, no, I'm gonna, I understand. I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, to I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the workout. Okay. Whatever you want. Here. Three there's, three. No, there's no pressure here. <laughs> there's no. So 10 people tomorrow, 3.30, Saturday, signed, contracted. Or I will sue are them in civil court. Are you gonna get Tim to do this? I'm, I'm trying to. Where is he? As he walked outside, food is supposed to come soon. So. Yeah. How's his voice? It's better. Okay. A little bit better. Yeah. Cool. Rescue one. Can you advise the local number? To call? Rescue one. What was your line? Can you see if that was a local number that called, or if you can get a location on the call? Yeah, we're working on that now. She's trying to pull back up. All right. I'm pretty sure this is probably gonna be a swatting call. They're shooting a um, political film inside the residence here. In the 1918 Spanish flu, there were 57 pandemics, and there was only four cases of them that didn't result in a revolt or large-scale protest afterwards. And they actually announced a number of times. Yeah, the cops just walked in. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Uh, should we? Uh, yeah, that I. So. I was, I was looking at my notes and I was like, "Somebody, did somebody swat you?" Yep, somebody swatted us. Did someone they really? Swatted us? Yep, somebody swatted us. So that's how do you know? How was. do you know? I have somebody texting me. Oh, yeah, okay. So Tim's gonna wow. Go take care of so, business. yeah, just a police officer just entered here, looked around because it looks like someone swatted this live <laughs> broadcast here. Glad they didn't come in here busting, man. I'm yeah. glad. Yeah, yeah, man. I mean, that's. That's something that's extremely dangerous. <clears throat> we got a we got a call saying that two people were shot and another was threatening suicide. <clears throat> Is this sealed off? Yeah, it's an attic. That's completely sealed or no? Yes, uh, as far as I know. Or can you lift that? Uh, I think they're still doing work on it. Like they put that down. I'm not sure what they're doing. With the key, but it, yeah, it's like they're. they're What's that? The roof is uh, sealed. Okay. All right. So steps, steps, but it goes to like a roof of that wall. Okay. I mean, there's a locked door in there. You see, there is a locked door in here. Yeah. Do you have a key for that door? I don't. No. Here you go. Yep. Regardless of the circumstances, and I'd appreciate it if you would leave. Okay. Well, we checked the entire house. We just checked the upstairs. Did we get the whole? You were with us the whole time, sir. Is the whole? Did we go through the whole ground floor? Yeah. It's the whole okay. House. Okay. I, I respect the attempt of keeping everybody safe and everything, but yeah, and, and that's look. That is the only reason we were doing what we're doing. We want to make sure everybody here was okay, and you know, we have yeah. to answer any other questions you have. No, no, just uh, would be would appreciate it if you guys would. Okay. Excellent. All right. Look, I appreciate you talking to the proper Yeah, yeah. All right. Sorry for the what, what they're doing. The uh, yeah. I mean, you're you're good, man. Have a good one, dude. Thank you. Yep. Yep. All good. Yep. All good. 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 All
they were trying to make it. Was Alice open. okay? Yeah, Beth, I had to let them know that she was. That's absolutely yeah, yeah, swatting that's fine. Attempt. They were hoping it would go bad. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was swatting, but definitely. It didn't. Right here. I would trying put to kill ten. Us. Yep. Oh, thank you. I was nervous. You asked them for a warrant. I did ask them for a warrant. The reason they could yeah, come in is for this. Yeah, we asked for a warrant. They said we're going in anyway. Exigent circumstance. They said they're going in anyway. They don't have It's because of exigent circumstance. It's a real thing. They were real cool. It's just a slide. Regardless, a crime. Good job. Thank you. Uh, I just walked out of the room. The cops walked in. They walked around with flashlights. We've been swatted. I am extremely unhappy with this because... I can't necessarily be mad at the officers. They were very polite, but I do not like cops coming into my house when we have mats all over no the place. Warrant? They come back with a warrant. Yeah. And I don't know who let them in or why. Yeah, what happened? Uh, I understand they're here because we got swatted. A report was made that two people had been shot and killed Jeez. and that the gunman was threatening to, to hurt themselves. They didn't send a SWAT team. It was just a couple of officers. I don't want to drag them or be mean to them because they were polite. But I'm not happy with the idea that they're walking into our studio while we are live. They're walking around. Cop immediately, I, I walked out of the room. He immediately came up and said, I'm really, really sorry about this. We're not trying to, you know, screw with you or, or, or ruin what you're doing. Here's what happened. We got a call. Two people had been shot and killed and a person was going to be killing themselves. We have to check it out and make sure everything's okay. We're going to be doing a sweep once we figure it out. And I'm just like... Come but back with a warrant. What I heard you, you call me because there were cops out here. I was like, oh. They're like, well, they, I actually was like, let me just go up there. And they were like, no, you got to stay here. I was like, okay. I, Dude, something, like, I think I've really answered really because I know sometimes you don't. And I was like, and I was like, did they tell you what they thought? They and should, I was they like, heard? shoot, because I just knew you were, might not answer. <laughs> so I was like, and they, they stopped me. They're like, we didn't ask you to go up there. I was like, all okay, right, yeah. no problem. Because <laughs> they walked up to me, they were like, we got to call that someone was mur like, mur what? <laughs> 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 I know, I felt bad because. I was psyching up to your place. They're like, who's, who's there? Area. Someone lives there. I and I was like, I go, he the stays there. Like, he lives with us. <laughs> I looked at Andy. I go, who the hell here's Mary? Well, so I was walking, <laughs> yeah, I was, I was walking out to, the, to go skate in the barn. And like this, these lights are out by the beginning of the driveway. Uh, yeah. And I was just like, what the hell is that? And like I thought maybe like somebody stopped to read a text message before driving up, and I started yeah. like walking a little towards it to see who it was. And I hear like, "Put your hands up, sir." I was like, uh, "I think it's the the cops. You got to put your hands up." He's like, "What?" Wow. I had I had like a, a 360 so camera in my hand, and he's totally gonna think this is a gun. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, because I know exactly, you know, not to have them come in without anything. I was like, if I can't stop it, so what am I supposed to do, you know? It's yeah, like, I mean, well, there was like 10 cops there, and, and you were like, you can't come in without a warrant, and they were just like, yeah, well, we're going to go in anyway. They had the reason, and exigent circumstance, yes. I've got their, you know, information. I took pictures yeah. of their license plates and everything, so okay. I've got their hands We there. actually talked to the local police departments and explain to him what, what swatting yeah. is. I tried to explain So it's it. not going to work. I, I explained that oh, to him. Oh, that's guy. why they came all yeah. cool. It, it's whatever. I told they him with like shotguns. Other people that's happened to it, it goes bad real fast. Yeah, and yeah, they, they, a lot of people who are more popular have to talk to their local. This is one yeah. of those guys that's yeah, so it'll never jumpy. work. Like, yeah, the, the yeah. one guy from Washington County, like, because it was his call. He was <laughs> the one like, got to talk to you. We knew where you're going in. So yeah. he was, but. I understand. You get a call like that, you have to see that the They have something. to check. Yeah. And so, because exactly. he tried to even be, he tried to be like, well, when does the show end? We're like, like 11. He's like, well, we can't wait that long. Right. Like, Exigent circumstances. Right. Which we can enter right. your property ah, and search the that. premises. Right, which is what I said. I told him, with respect, officers, I would like you to leave unless you have a warrant. And they said, we get it, we get it. We swept the house, we're leaving. But that's, I, don't, I don't trust it. <laughs> Guy is like shining a light on us, and I've got like this long thing, and I'm like, it's not a shotgun. We have to bring it in. Jesus Christ, that whole thing was fucking insane. Could have gone way worse though. Bad boy. Yeah, yeah.